welcome to another one of my testing videos. I say this in every video so feel free to skip ahead but if you're new to this video or this channel I am doing a week of testing makeup brands and weird products and just random things like that. So there'll be a new testing video every weekday at 4.30 and 12pm on the weekends and I hope that you guys stick around. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see the rest of these videos and my videos in general. But yeah, today we are going to be testing this from Clarins. It's a Skin Illusion Blusher. It's literally a stamp and I know that these have been around for a couple of years now I know that 17 do one if you want a more affordable option but I've actually never tried them out so I thought what better way than to test it in this testing series because it's kind of a weird product so I've got these in three different shades I've got shade 01 luminous pink 02 luminous coral and 03 golden havana and I think I might try luminous pink just because I've got a pink top on so I think it would go more with the whole vibe of this video. The first thing I noticed about these products is they've actually got a mirror on the top and they come with one of them really satisfying things oh, to peel off. But the mirror is so zoomed in. I feel like that would be good for applying lipstick or something, but for blusher, you have to hold it so far away to see your face. So this product basically comes with a stamp on this side and then the stamp goes into a blusher here. So I guess if you wanted to, you could get a brush and use it that way. Like if you really liked the colour but not the way it applies, you could do that. But I'm just going to go for it straight from the pot and see what happens. Also, if you can hear things, I've got both of my cats in the room with me. And the kitten, Jeremy, is playing with some lights right now on a string, which he shouldn't be doing. And I keep telling him off, but he keeps going back to them. So I'm a bit like, what do I do? <laughs> I keep wiggling this bit of paper on the floor and he comes over, but then he goes back to them. This is Jeremy, in case you haven't seen him. He's gorgeous and I've done a whole video about him which I will leave as a link below if you want to watch it. Oh, he's my little baby. I feel like we should just jump straight into this so let's give it a go. I'm actually a bit nervous. So the colour is actually really gorgeous. It feels so nice and soft. I don't know if this is going to show up that well on my skin actually because my skin seems a lot darker than it right now. Should I just give it a go? Oh my god. I feel like I'm just going to have a big ring on my cheek. Oh, can you guys see that? I definitely wouldn't go out with it like this. But I feel like if I blend that in, it might actually look really nice. That's such a pretty colour. So I've just got a brush. Let's give it a go. It's definitely wiped away some of the product. So let's give it another stamp. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, I actually really like this and I really like the applicator, like that just went on the apples of my cheeks so perfectly. Look, this side has got a nice like tint of blusher on and this side hasn't. Should I try a different colour on the other side? Can't really ask you because obviously this is going up later than I'm filming it. You know what, let's try this coral on the other side because I'm not doing anything after this video so let's give it a go. Oh my god, it's got another... Oh. So that one is quite a light colour as well. I look like a clown. I'm going to do what I did before and just give it two dabs. Guys, that is such an easy application. I did not think I'd like these. I thought it would put too much product on and I would literally look like a clown. But that's blended out so nicely. I actually am really happy with this. I like the coral colour as well. I would say the only downfall of these is if you've got skin any darker than mine right now, it definitely wouldn't show up on it. At least these colours anyway are definitely catered towards more light skin although there is this golden havana one oh my god this looks gorgeous this actually looks so pretty shall i pop a bit of this okay so this is the shade of the golden havana one before i've blended it in this one definitely would work on a bit darker skin but yeah i don't think the lighter ones are bright enough for dark skin which is such a shame let's blend this in do you see how well that blends out I'm actually so surprised with these. 
I definitely put this too far on. But aside from that, I think these blushes are actually incredible. As I said, 17 do them. So if you want a more affordable option, definitely go and check them out. But these Clarins ones are really good. Obviously, I don't know the formula of them ones right now because I've never tried them. The mirror has actually come really in handy as well, and I guess that would be good for traveling. I'm actually so shocked by these. I would give these a five out of five. <laughs> Let me know what you think about them in the comments below and if this video was a bit shorter, I'm sorry, but yeah, they just worked really well. Definitely check out my testing videos so far and be sure to stay tuned for the rest of them which will be coming very, very shortly. Ow! Oh my god, Jeremy, no! Kittens have got the claws of death! I'm gonna head off now, but give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And definitely subscribe if you want to see more of my videos, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye, guys! <laughs>